packaged function in R to download and analyze returns for securities. So the first thing you'll want to do is open up your R console and type in a list of the stocks that you'd like to analyze. So here you can see there's six different stocks that we're analyzing. Uh, the SP, uh, S&P S, S, S &P, uh, index fund, as well as five others, including some uh, some bond funds. Uh, this is a list in R, and you can uh, you can see the structure, or you can see the actual um, list itself if you type out the name of the object. Next, we're going to actually. This is very simple. All you need to do is run the get returns function. And that's get returns with taking arguments of the list, list of the stocks that you're interested in, as well as the frequency. Here, we're going to uh, only look at weekly returns, and we're going to go back as far as the data is available by not specifying a start date. So we run this. That should only take a second. It comes right back. And we now have all the returns in this returns object. You can see a summary by issuing this command. Here again, it's got the information, it's the six stocks. Uh, the earliest week in which all of the securities had returns data was April 16th, 2007, and here is the average return. If you're interested, take a look at the structure of the returns object, which we'll use later in our analysis, and you can do this by using the str function. And you'll see that it contains a lot of data, including the actual raw return data. Uh, in, in this case, for this uh, for the S&P index fund, all the way back to 1993. And that's it. You now have the return data in an object and ready for analysis.